Hi there, my name's Andy Hillier, and in this video, I'm going to teach you how to play uh, a portrait of love from Hogwarts Legacy. Uh, it's from when he's playing, uh, there's a guy in the painting who plays like a, a lute, or it looks like a lute, and he plays this song. Uh, it's a beautiful little song. I've done a full playthrough, so if you want to hear what it sounds like all the way through, check that out. I'll leave a link in the description and a card above. Uh, there's two guitar parts. I'm going to teach you the lead guitar part. Um, I'll put the other guitar part on my Patreon page, so I'll put both parts on the Patreon page. So if you want to print them out, uh, go check them out, I'll leave a link to them in the description. Um, just before I teach you though, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier, give me a like on the video, it really does help the video get some more views, um, as does give me some comments, so please leave me some comments in the comment section. Let me know where in the world you're from, what songs I should do next. And if you love what I'm doing, you want to support me, you can support me on Patreon. My guitar is in standard tuning, I'm playing it on a classical guitar, would also work on acoustic guitar, or even electric guitar. Uh, so play on, on whatever you like. Okay, the first line sounds like this. Okay, so to play that, we start off with this little hammer on. Uh, so we're going from B7 with the first finger, hammer on to B8 with your second finger. Um, and I've also put a 9 on the G string, so I'm using my third finger on G9, and we're playing them at the same time. So that little hammer on. If you struggle to put your third finger there, you can just play the hammer on. And then we're going to play E7 twice. So you get And leave that seven a bit longer. You'll notice over the top, it's got a little dot with a, um, a sort of arch over the top of it. That's um, like a pause. So you, you, you hold it on a little bit longer than it normally would be. So it wouldn't go one, two, three, four, straight in. You get an extra little pause on it. So you make it last a little bit longer. Into bar two, we play G5 and B5 at the same time. Then E5 twice. And again, let that five last a little bit longer. And then into bar three, we play B5 and G5 again. And then play E3 twice. And then we get this. Which is E3, then E2, hammer on to E3 and pull off back to E2. So really quickly like this. So a little hammer on and pull off from two to three, back to two. Then play B4, then open B. So bar four goes. And again, that lasts slightly longer than uh, the two beats, but only just. Okay, so the whole of that first line goes. So that's the first line. On to the second line. It goes like this. So we're going to start with that same hammer on that we did. So G9, first finger on B7, and hammer on your second finger onto the B8. Then E7, E7. E5, back to E7, so bar 5 goes. Next bar goes. So E8, E7, E5, E7, then open E. So bar 6. Bar 7, you've just got is E5, B8, B7, then B5, so bar 7, then bar 8 goes, which is on the B string, so B4, B5, B7, then open B. So the whole line goes. On 
to the next line and we've got this. So to play it, open E, E7, E7, and then E5, E7. So bar nine. Then you go up to E8, then slide up to E10, back to E8, E7, and then B8. There's a slight little pause on that um, B8 as well. It lasts a little bit longer. So we've got this uh, first two bars. Then bar 11, we play B10, B8, hammer on to B10 and pull off to B8. A little quick line that, so you got. Then play B7, B8, and then B7, hammer on to B8, pull off to B7. Then B5, so bar 11. Bar 12 goes B7, B5. A quick hammer on from B4 to B5, back to B4. And then B5. So the whole line. To the next line, and we've got so we're going to play E7 and G7 at the same time, then B8, then E5 and G7, then B7. So you get. Then B8, B7, B5, and then B4. So you get. Bar 15 it goes to E7 and G7 at the same time. Then B8, then E8 and G9, then B10. Back to E7 and uh, G7 in bar 16. Then E5, B8, E5. So the whole line goes. On to the next line, and we've got this. E7, then B8 and G9 at the same time, then E5, B7. So first bar of that line goes. Then we've got B8, uh, B7, hammer on to B8, pull off to B7, then B5 and B4. So the first two bars of that line go. Then bar 19, you get, which is B5, B7, B8, E5, then B7. So you get. Then we're gonna play B8, B7, hammers onto B8 and pulls back off to the B7. Then B4 and B5. So the whole of that line you get. On to the next line and we get this. So 
So we're gonna play the G9 and B8 at the same time. Then E7, E7, E5, E7, then E5, E7, going into E8 in the next bar. Then E10, E8, E7. So the first two bars of that line go. Then it goes to E5, then E7, E5, B8, then B7, B8, B7. So bars uh, 23 and 24 go. So the whole line. On to the next line, uh, or the second page, if you've printed this out uh, from my Patreon page. Um, we've got... So for that, we've got open E, then E7, another E7, and then you hammer on with the little finger, or you, you could use your third finger, whichever you prefer. So you play the seven, hammer on to eight, pull off to the seven, and then pull off to the five. So it goes from the beginning of that line. And then another E7 on the end, so. Then E8, hammer on from E8 to E10. And then E8, hammer on to E10, and pull off to the E8 really quickly. Then E7, and then open E. You'll see I put a P above it, just play that note quiet. Um, so the first two bars go. And then we're gonna go E5, E7, E5, E3, then open E, E3 again. Then E2, with a hammer on, and pull off. So E2, E3, back to E2, and then play a B5. So the whole of that line goes. On to the next line, and we've got this. So G4, G5, G4, G2, G4, then a quick hammer on from G2 to G4, back to G2. So we've got uh, sorry. Then open G. Quick hammer on from G to G2. Then G. Hammer on to G2. Pull off again to the G and then uh, D4. So uh, first two bars go. And then we get this nice little bit that goes. G4, help me if I get the right note, then D5, G4, B7, then G5, D7, jumping up to B8, B7, B8, then G7, D9, G7, and then D7 to finish. So the whole of that line goes, to the next line and we've got which 
changes, open B, then E7, E5, E7, B7, B8, B7, B5, then B4. So first two bars. And then we go into the next bar, we've got B5, then B8, B7, B8, E, uh, sorry, B10, then B12, slide down to B4, and then play B5. So the whole line. On to the next line, and we've got... So that's E, E7, E7, E5, E7, E8, E7, E5, E7, then E. First two bars. Then E5, B8, B7, B5, B4, B5, B7, then G4, then B4. So the whole line. On to the next line, and we've got... So that's E, E7, E7, E5, E7, E8. Slide up to E10, back to E8, E7, then B5. So the whole uh, first two bars of that line go. Then on the B string, go B10, B8, B7, B8, B7, B5, B7, B5, B4, and then E3 with B5 at the same time. Okay, so the whole of that line goes. On to the next line, and we've got this. which is uh, same as another line that we've played. So E7 and B, uh, G7 at the same time. Then B8, E5 and G7. Then B7, B8, B7, B5, B4. Then back up to E7 and G7 at the same time. B8, E8 and G9. B10, then E7 and G7. E5. B8, and then E5. So the whole line. And onto the last line, we've got this. So E7, 
then B8 and G9, E5, B7, B8, B7 hammer onto B8 and pull off to the B7, then B5, B7, then B4, the first two bars. Then we go B5, B7, B8, E5, then B7, B8, hammer on from B7 to B8, pull off to B7, then B4, then B5 to finish. So the whole of that last line goes. And put a bit of a rowl on it, slow it down towards the end, uh, and then that's the whole song. Well, well done if you got all the way through that, it's quite a long one. Um, hopefully you've enjoyed this little video. If you have, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier. Give me a like on the video, press the notifications, and if you want to print the tabs off for this, then I'll put them on my Patreon page. I'll leave a link to that in the description. I'll also put the second guitar part, because there's two guitar parts. Hopefully you have checked out my uh, version of it and watched it all the way through. Let me know what you think of that video, let me know what you think of this video. Uh, thanks for watching this, I do appreciate it. I've been Andy Hillier, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.